I'm now sitting in the Polestar 1 and it's a verification prototype so it's the last version of the car before it goes into production and I'm sitting next to one of the Swedish vehicle testing engineer legends, right? Yeah. 10 years at Volvo and now leading the way for Polestar, Joachim. Mm. Yeah. Thank That's you very much. True. Okay, here we go. Yep. Let's do a power check. Yep. Awesome, 600 horsepower. Yep. 340 from the from the petrol engine. Whoa! And the brakes. 600 Huge brakes. Yeah, yeah, massive, massive. <laughs> so 340 horsepower from the petrol engine, 260 horsepower from the electric engine. Yes. And 1,000 newton meter. 1,000 newton meter, yes. of course. That's the key. That's the key. We just felt those. And of course, very, very special that it's the longest range for a hybrid car out there on the market when it comes to market, right? Yep. Which is 150 kilometers fully electric. So we can do that in a second. So, uh, what is the price point going to be when it comes out? 160,000. 160,000. Yeah. No, yeah. it feels made, of course. Some more attributes about this car. So a lot of the bodywork is in carbon to save a lot of weight. Weight, so that's very, very special. You've done a great job with that. And of course, that's also very good for torsional stiffness, which is just what I felt in cornering. This thing feels pretty racy, which is a really nice feeling. Looking good. Are we ready with this? Okay. Thank you very much. That was a pleasure. It's my pleasure. What I like most about this car is its racy feel. When you're driving it, you can see that Joaquim put a lot of effort into making the vehicle dynamics and the driving feel like perfect and very sporty. And I mean, even all the touches, when you see the, the brakes, Akabono, it's a, it's a racing brake, uh, one, one solid piece of aluminium, six pistons. So when I'm braking, you know, it's like, bam, you feel like it's a really, really great feeling. And so that I appreciate a lot. So I think it's, uh, it's an exciting, Power exciting company is coming around and uh, it'll be great to see when they start delivering their first months. Diamond in the rough, trying to get my shine. They might say I'm crazy, I'm just all my They might say I'm crazy, I just crush my mind. Diamond in the rough, trying to get my shine. This is amazing, With no? the ambassador. This is, this, is, <laughs> this is very cool, no? Amazing. We only miss the desert. One detail I really like, have a look at the rear seats. The rear seats are designed as a hammock. And the idea is, you know, if you find a nice place in the mountains, for example, and like you want to join this place for more, like longer more than one minute, you can easily take them out and put them in between a tree and enjoy the nice landscape. That's the idea. I, lo I, love, I love this detail. The main headline are the drones on the roof track. The drones are able to fly ahead and illuminate, which is perfect, in a right angle, right angle, the track. I love this idea. And it makes sense for an SUV. That's crazy. Are they on the roof now? No, yeah, they're on the roof now, sure. Oh, really? No, That's crazy. You're, you're gonna buy one, Jean? <laughs> you're gonna buy one? Maybe we could, uh, you could know, two. We, we share. We share, oh. we share. Uh, I'm in, I'm in. Okay. Need to find a place to use it, but I'm in. And then we do a rally together. Ah, Find sure, it. sure, sure. Now we have to know that all four show cars are one family. Yep. We have an idea that because I'm out in demand, uh, our future customers, they get access yeah. to a fleet of four cars. Yeah, subscription. Four main uh, use, four main use cases. Yeah. And this car is designed for use case off-road, without any compromise. And it yeah. shows how a car will look different if you do it without any compromise. You know, a production car today, of course, of course. you have to combine so many characteristics. Yeah, yeah. It's a compromise, finally. Wow, this is mad. Have a look at this one. Please, please have a seat. We'll jump in now here with you. Wow. So this is the future, future R8. Unbelievable. How, so the cool, idea is, how the idea cool is that? Wow, that is tight, huh? It's designed that as a two-seater. Tight, uh, tight seat. Tight so you fit. drive you drive with your wife from maybe from here to Nürburgring. Yeah. When you arrive at the Nürburgring, your, your wife could go to the hotel, have some wellness time. And you go to the racetrack. And the idea is that the seat what and the, the steering hell? wheel is a, is a monocoque. On. We're driving across at the moment within and the And then you're going to the center. And as you know, best driving position for a race car is the center. Yeah. And there's another nice detail. Check this out. This display is see-through, it's an OLED, so you look during the drive, through the steering wheel, display and the single frame, which is only a window, yeah. direct on the racetrack. Unbelievable. Very, very cool. This is awesome. Long distance is big. Certainly big. And probably very, very comfortable inside as well. Check it out. It's like, it's like your living room on wheels. 
very, very cool. So what they've done here is they've made one car for each use case. And I think it's very, very cool. And particularly this race car one, it really looks awesome. It looks awesome, fully electric. I really like what they're doing. And I hope for once that this concept also will become reality in a couple of years. That would be awesome. My father is a massive Defender fan. He has like three, he tunes them up, rebuilds them, remakes them, renovates them and everything. This is the new version of the legendary Defender. And Verdict, I think, looks very, very cool. You all well? Very good? good? Yeah. Yeah. Have a good show? Yes, very good. Getting busy. What, what's your favorite so far? Oh gosh, oh gosh. Is it okay to take you on YouTube? Uh, yeah, yeah, for sure. You don't sure. mind YouTube? I don't mind YouTube. It's okay. I heard of it. It's okay. You make these video things sometimes. Favorite so far, come on. Favorite so far. So, controversial. One, one, controversial. One, one. But I like the Concept 4. Yeah. Concept With the new four. grills, the, 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 the thing that BMW is showing. It's been, uh, people are like, they hate it or they love it. Okay. I quite like it. Uh, what else do we have? What about the Sian? I was going to say, the come Lamborghini. It looks better in person than pictures. Have you put in a deposit already? <laughs> I wish. Come on, from all the cash, come you on, have you? From all the cash you're generating, come on. It doesn't work Where's like it? that. It doesn't work Where's like the that. Deposit down there are only 63 or? cars. Yeah, but come on. And it's 2, mil it's 2 million and 10,000 oh, euros you're, you're plus Shmi taxes. How much? 2 million and 10,000 euros plus taxes plus specification. Whoa. That's a big car. But it's cool. First Lamborghini hybrid. So you're still like, you're still in, no, in no, the consideration? No, not for me. Not for me. Okay. I'll see you later. Have a good show. the Lamborghini new hybrid and it's looking absolutely epic there's only 60 being made 2 million euros I think this is an absolute beast and I'm filming here with Matt from Car Wow oh, how so you check doing? out the channel Car Wow really really epic stuff great on the drag racing yeah everything has been drag raced that yeah. can be drag race we should drag race and we should drag race Definitely. so that's coming up soon I, Fine, make I can I can do the engine part go on you do the I engine I mean that that's really so it's naturally aspirated V12 6.5 liter yeah. how good does that sound how much and I love power? 815. Oh my god, he knew it. <laughs> <laughs> How no, much torque? How much torque? Oh, 630? No, 760. <laughs> but no, honestly, I love the LaFerrari had it first, I think. This yeah. combination of V12 with the hybrid. Yes, yeah, so I think it's motor. beautiful because you get the sound, but you get the hybrid combination. I think it's perfect. So well done, Lamborghini. This is good. This is one very, very exciting car. Do you right? have the performance figures on this? Uh, yes, I do. Oh my goodness. Go on. So it's 0 to 60, 2.8 seconds. Bang on. Right? Bang on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a guess. But anyway, I'm good at this. Okay. That was a guess. And top speed in excess, 221 miles an hour. Really? Fastest wow. Lamborghini ever. Wow, that's that's awesome. And really, I, I, I think it looks like very, very special. Huh? Yes. Looks Looks really, really good. I really, really like when they, when uh, car manufacturers manage to revive like classic designs from the past successfully. And here you'll see a lot of M1 in it. And of course, M1 is one of the great classic legends. So I think that's uh, that's a fun touch. Jens Tima, CMO from BMW, and we know each other for a long time. Absolutely. We were really both good. at Daimler before. Absolutely. Happy to have good you time. here in our booth. Thank uh, you very so much. Okay, let's check cool. it out. Absolutely. Have a seat. So definitely very futuristic interior here. Very, very cool steering wheel. My God, it looks like a fighter jet in here. Unbelievable, very very racy. That's nice to see, yeah. With all this, uh, with all this autonomy and everything coming up, that they still like consider a concept to go full racy. This is really really, uh, of course, something I like. Thank you for watching. I has been a great experience. I'll tell, take you through my highlights. Definitely, the Lamborghini Sian has to be a highlight. Just an epic car and uh, very very exclusive and super cool hybrid, fastest Lamborghini ever. Then I really like this BMW 4 Series. Just like the design, it's really really uh, really aggressive very very nice uh, I like the Audi buggy I'm taking that one <laughs> one day and what else did I like one more one more oh Mercedes Mercedes the EQS thought it was a very cool uh, cool concept for the future there for the luxury oh he says put it further for the luxury Mercedes 
and what else I have forgotten anything else thank you very much for watching subscribe to the channel and hit the notification button oh I forgot the M next I forgot the M next really like it M next is cool